गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट और टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू टीच यू अबाउट अ वेरी स्पेशल टाइप ऑफ प्रिमिटिव सेल कॉल्ड और यूनिट सेल कॉल्ड विजनस जाइट सेल और वेरी ऑफन आल्सो कॉल्ड ए विजनस जाइट यूनिट सेल सो टू नो दिस फर्स्ट लेट अस गो टू व्हाट इट इज ए विजनस इज सेल इज ए स्पेशल टाइप ऑफ प्रिमेटिव यूनिट सेल एंड इट इज नेम्ड आफ्टर यू कैन विग्नर एंड फेडरिक जाइट फॉर एनी गिवेन लाट इज देर कैन बी इन्फाइनाइट नंबर ऑफ पॉसिबल प्रिमेटिव सेल्स हाउ आर देर इज ओनली वन विग्नर जाइट सेल फॉर एनी गिवेन लाट इज now generally the this uh, this uh, unit cell represent the uh, the locus of points in space that are closer to the lattice point than to any of the other lattice points now the last thing about this is the shaded region in the figure uh, is the uh, the Ignatite uh, cell. Now let us see this figure. This is the figure. Now in this figure, you can see the red dot points. Red dot points are our lattice points. Now uh, and this shaded region, which has been constructed by a very special means, this shaded region, orange shaded region, uh, you can see. <coughs> you can see this orange shaded region this one this one this uh, this encloses one lattice point only one lattice point and that is the wignerite cell and other other cells are also these are also uh, some wignerite cells okay and you can see the whole crystal can be constructed by repetition of this unit cell okay and uh, in the uh, crystallography this cell has a very unique role uh, particularly the in the reciprocal lattice uh, space this space this uh, this has a lot of uh, uh, important role in defining the crystal structure okay now we'll see how this cell okay uh, that is what i told you that uh, it is able, uh, it is able to build the whole or it it, it can be uh, repeated many times to create the whole crystal okay or whole lattice system now uh, let us see how we can create a wignerite cell which i have been uh, written as ws cell ws stand for wigner jait okay now for construction the general method that is followed is first you have to go for okay uh, generally we have to go for a method called vernoy uh, decomposition method to create such uh, Uh, Wigner-Jait cells. Now let us see what it is. For this Wernoy method, you have to go for first. You have to choose any lattice point and draw connecting line to its closest neighbors. Now you see in the figure here, in the top figure, these are the lattice points. The all these are the lattice points. Okay, these are the lattice points. Now uh, this is also one lattice point. Now you can see in this figure seven lattice points are there. Now I have chosen one of them. This red one has been chosen. Now let us connect this uh, this uh, lattice point to the neighboring lattice points. So the black lines uh, are the connecting lines here. Okay. So now. after you connect all the lines you can see uh, because there are six uh, lattice po uh, point around the this red, red one so uh, there are six lines you have 
connected okay so here i am writing the black lines okay okay now after drawing this line you go for constructing the perpendicular bisector of these connecting lines now you see in this figure the red lines the red lines here are the perpendicular bisectors Uh, now you look at this this is one, this is one perpendicular bisector to the this uh, red line first red, red line let's say if i name o a so the uh, o a is the line that you have drawn for connecting the uh, lattice point at o to the lattice point at a now you have give, uh, drawn this perpendicular bisector let's say this one okay this red one Similarly, you can uh, create or construct the next perpendicular line here. This is the second perpendicular line. Then the third perpendicular line, fourth perpendicular line, fifth perpendicular line, and the sixth perpendicular line. Now, now. <coughs> Now, the, uh, the region that enclosed by these perpendicular lines are uh, also represent the Wignerite cell. So, you can see this is the region then represented, represent the WS cell. Now, you see for all such uh, neighboring uh, lattice point you can have lot of other wignerite cells okay like this all these are also wignerite cells so this uh, this uh, <coughs> this one uh, this i have uh, shown as a selection one but others are also wignerite cells okay so this is the general method of constructing the wignerite cell thank you